welcome back to my channel fun and love with my name. in today's video we're going to look at the ms word introduction so let's get started shall we so press the windows button and you can type over here word or you may just go and search till www and click that there So we want a blank one, so let's put that. Yeah. So now we're gonna learn about font styles the first. So let me write So now we'll look at font styles. So this is the font box, paragraph, and styles. Now we're going at this to change our handwriting. So if you click on Algerian, it'll change agent, Algerian. We have many. So you may choose whatever you like. I like this one. So now it's so small. So let's size it up a little. You see this box? Click on that. And then we have big, big, big. So let's keep it at 22. So now, after this is done, we we'll look at how to make this bold. To make some message important, we will do this as bold. You have may even seen in Wikipedia they hyperlink stuff to make that thing that this is the place of the picture or they make that bold this is important word in a textbook. So, so let's make this bold. So this is now bold, so this shows that this is main. Now if I click this, this will be slanted. And if I click this, it will be underlined. And we have different types of underline. You can choose this, this, any one. I'll choose this. This looks nice. So now, now we have made it slant. Now if you write also, it will be slanted. Now how do you undo it? Now undo this and write normally. And how do you want the underline to go? Just click none. Okay? Just off this. Now you write happy. But this is bold because we forgot to turn off the bold button. Now if you write happy, it's normal. So now we have known how to do it bold, make it slant or elastic or underlined. Now how do you make a word cross? Strike through it. Now select your, any word and now click on one. Now this is crossed. I mean this is a wrong word. Like we have made seen when we are writing in pen, we cross out the word. Like that and word is also there. Now what do you, what do, you do if you don't want it? Now off it. It's now not crossed. Now let's look at how do you want to color this. Now click over here and change the color. If you want more colors, you have a colorful wheel. Now you can change any color. Okay. And this will line. But I want a little dark red. So now this you may notice something when you're writing a heading you want that to be in the center then your paragraph wants to start right so now why don't we make this also like that so now let's look in the paragraph section and then we have we can click this and we'll go to middle because these four mean this means left side if you click this it will go to left this will go to the center and this will go to the right and this is justified like normal now if you want bullet points what do you want 
so you can choose any of the bullet points. I like this. So now, what if you don't want a bullet point? If you want to number it, choose this. Let's take one. What if you want this? Choose any one of those. Let's say like this. Now see, if we enter it, it will be like that. Now we know the basic stuff of word. Now let's go to this. What happens if we click this? What happens if we click this or this? These means how you can arrange your title or any other stuff. Suppose normal, this will be a normal. This is normal. No spacing. It will be same. Heading, be, it will be like this. Now if you want, to, if you're writing a story, let's say The Wicked Witch Now this is the, suppose this is a story that I want to write Now you see this is heading 2, heading 1, title So click title And then you can start your story, some, writing something, something so now, what if you want more? You can underline this, this. Let's see if we, let's just control A that. And if you look to more, it'll be like that, like this, like that. Any one you want, but I'm sticking with title. Now, now, now if you have covered the home tab, every, the basic stuff, let's go to insert tab. An insert tab we'll be learning about clip art and how to insert a picture. What do you mean by clip art? Let's see it. Clip art if you click it, see. You can instead of going to a new Chrome tab and searching stuff, something like that, you can directly search it over here. Let's say you wanna mm, hello picture. Now press go and then you have different types of hello. Now let me select it. I choose this one. Insert. Now this will be ours. And that's how you do for that. Now suppose you're f you're not getting the picture that you want from Clipart, and you need to go to picture and search it up. So now select your stuff, go to your stuff, and select the picture that you want. So let's say I will choose. Suppose I'll choose this. Then I then I have this over here. Now, if you look at this, when we just open this, we have a new picture tools format. Click on now. If you click on this, this is turning like that. Now if you click on more, if you can do it like that, this, anything. You can also keep it like this. So now, once we have covered this, now let's. If you're writing, let's say you're doing a math homework, and you and you need shapes. So click on shapes. You can use any shape and mention it. Let's say I'll keep it over here and enter that. And you can write beside that this is a rectangle and a one. Now let's go to insert, same tab. Now, suppose you're making a table. 
suppose you're making a table for the best pastries or anything. So now click table. Now, as you can see, we have, once we're doing like this, we have all amount of tables, the whole 10 by 8. Now say you want 2 by 8, 2 by 4, 2 by 3, anything. So I want, let's say I want this much. Now, now if you see, we have new stuff. Now you can do it like this, and this will be like that. Now this will be a design. So if you want this, you can change it, color, anything. So let's choose a nice one. alignment and you have it right there so now let's say I'll write my name now this is again coming over here change it to here and write let's say some other person's name a friend's name anything so now you have understood how to the main concepts of home tab and insert tab the main stuff. Now let's erase this table. Now let's say like you have seen in Wikipedia they have the letters way bigger fun and then they go down right. We're gonna do the same thing. Let's write There was, there was a old man. Now, this is our sentence. Let's make it a little bigger by going to home tab and select my size. Let's check our. Okay. Now, in in insert tab in the same we have drop cap you want this or in margin so let's say this or you want none that it's okay so now I want this just like in Wikipedia you can straighten this stuff out and make it now just like in Wikipedia but now I don't want this T over here let's say I want an A or according to a sentence you can choose anything so now word art you can design your own word let's say word word art so now let's see let's just select this okay now then we have diff and we have this. You can choose more, word art, anything. You can do it horizontal or anything. I want this one. So after I type, I can write, okay, anything you want. Now we have learned about home tab and insert tab. Now let's look at some features in page layout. Now in page layout, we can do many things. Let's say page borders. Let's click on that. Now we, like in normal papers, you draw a border and then write inside it. Same thing in Word. Now you can choose your own type one and do it. Let's say you can choose your own style. I'm going to choose this one and choose your own color. 
I'm gonna do red. Now you want the whole document, not the first one. So if you want more, just select anything or okay. So now press okay. Okay. Then we have it like this. So now we have our own line. You can extend it to make it bigger. That can draw a number line or anything. Or you can make it short as well. Now press right click and now this is for borders. Now what about a page color? You can color the whole entire page with this itself. Now if you write, it'll come in white. Now if you want to write, let's make an interesting topic. Let's just write. The old man. It's the heading. Now we'll write. Stay tuned. So until then, stay home, stay safe, and bye.